Hello, brothers and sisters in Christ of Truth Inspired. My name is Atticus Schaefer. I am so happy to be making this video for you today because I get to talk about one of my favorite things ever, my faith in Jesus Christ. Um, there are so many aspects and details of my testimony that I just simply could not get into um, in, a, in, a, in a short video like this, uh, but I will say that um, I was raised by my mom and uh my mom she she was the epitome of gently leading me to Christ. Uh my mom she was uh she was a big part of my life where she gently planted seeds, uh told me stories from the Bible, told me about the finished work of the cross um all while I was growing up. And when I was 13 years old, actually in a hospital bed while recovering from a surgery from a very bad accident that I endured, um, I gave my life to Christ. And then later on, uh, in 2015, I was baptized. Um, I have witnessed the Lord do so many wonderful things in my life, not only for me personally, but even, even more beautifully for others that I've had the pleasure of being able to interact with and pray for and, um, and just be able to witness. Um, I think that we live in times these days where while it is very important that we as the body of Christ, that we do the work that we have been commissioned to do and uh, to, to spread the word and to um, obviously baptize people in the name of the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit. Uh, ministering to people. I think that's very important that we need to do, um, obviously, to those who have not heard of the truth of the gospel. But I think we live in times where it is very important that we also uplift each other. As uh, the Apostle Peter and Paul would frequently write to the churches of old, that it's important that iron sharpens iron and that we we come together in familial love, brotherly love, and uplift each other. I think that we need to be doing that all the more in today's time. Times. And so today, uh, I would very much love to share with you all a scripture that is very important to me. Um, I know that many of you will probably be familiar with the scripture, but it is Jeremiah 29, 11. Uh, for this year specifically, this scripture has meant a lot to me as well as for many years past. But uh, Jeremiah 29, 11, for I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord, plans to prosper you and not to harm you, plans to give you hope and a future. My dear friend, brother, or sister in Christ, if you are in Christ, if you have believed in your heart uh, in the finished work of the cross and in the gospel of our Lord Jesus Christ, then this truth is for you. And I hope that it can not only be a blessing, but an encouragement and inspiration to you on this day as you continue your walk with our Lord, who is a risen king, and he is he who does not know defeat. God bless you always. This is Atticus Schaefer, Love in Christ to you.